Lee and DJ for the pop in. V180 on a Saturday. You know how it goes. We uh, Leah pops in here and uh, we try to get a bit real. We do. We try to get a bit uh, transparent. Yeah. Um, be a bit vulnerable. Absolutely. Um, we might even come in here with green nail polish on. Hey, hey. Have that. <laughs> green and sparkly. Thank you very much. They're very green and They're sparkly. My, my, my mermaid nails. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> <laughs> I love. It. Well, we're not here to talk about uh, your mermaid nails. What no. we are here to talk about is something that I think is the most controversial thing going on in Australia right now. Yes. And we're going to talk about it because we love to talk about the hard issues here at V One Eighty. We do. Um, and, and we're going to talk about it in a way that I hope, I hope and pray glorifies God and encourages everybody, no matter which side of the fence you're sitting on, or mm. even you're still sitting on the middle of the fence, yeah. where it's a bit painful, but you're thinking, I don't know which side to jump on. We're talking about the yes vote. Yeah. The referendum. Okay. The the voice to parliament, the indigenous Aboriginal voice to par- parliament, that is all that's on the news at the moment. Yeah. It's all that every politician's on. If you're on social media, everybody's posting on it's it either there. side. Yeah. I was driving down the highway, uh, you know, from home from uh, Vision the other day, and there was a whole ton of uni student age people, uh, 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 you know, and again, I'm just going from what they look like on their skin yeah. colour, so uh, sorry if this is racist. Uh, you know, a bunch of them looked like they were indigenous. Yep. A bunch of them looked like they were, you know, white fellas. They could have been Indigenous, so, you know, they could, could have, have identified that, that way. Who knows? And uh, they were all wearing uh, Indigenous shirts, Aboriginal yeah. flags, and they were waving them up there. Vote no. Vote wow. no. Do not divide us. Don't divide us yeah. type of thing. I've seen down in uh, where I've been living for the last 10 years, down in Geelong and Melbourne and Victoria, mm. big marches on the other side. Vote yes. Yes yeah. will bring us together. Yes is the only answer for Australia. So I've seen both sides of the coin there. We don't yeah. want to tell you what to vote. No. But we did not. want to touch on something that's happened on our social media, on Facebook yes. and Instagram. Yes, yes. Oh, goodness me. Yeah. So uh, what's happened over the last week, mm. um, we posted, well, Tony Davenport, one of yes. our news writers, uh, he wrote an article uh, pretty much reporting on the, the Presbyterian Church in Australia. Yes. Um, and they've decided to that it's no longer going to happen, banning the uh, welcome to country practices in the church services. Yes, yes. So, so that's an important line to in, say in, in the, the church, church in a service. Sunday church service. Yes, yes. So and they've so, said they've said if you want to do welcome to country, and if you don't know what welcome to country yeah, is, yeah. So how would pretty, you explain it? Oh goodness me! So basically, it's they get um, um, there's a member from the indigenous community. Yes, they come out and they do uh, whatever they would normally. do. Do. I don't even know how to really explain it. Yeah, they, they do a bit of a people, dance. Sometimes there's a didgeridoo. Sometimes yeah. there's some, um, they burn some leaves or something like that. Yeah. Sometimes. Or even They're sometimes. A little bit different. Yeah. Sometimes they just get up and say, on behalf of the, you know, the yeah. traditional owners of the land, we, we welcome you here. Yes. Uh, I've seen ones, and we, we we saw one recently where he he didn't really welcome everybody. He no. he said we are all part of Australia. Yes, which we're is lovely. We're all part of the land. Um, you know, we're, we're all here to be Australians together. Yeah. And I was like, okay, that's not coming from an indigenous indigenous uh, you know uh, guy who had tr- who had ancestors in that local area. Yeah. So it's it's a little bit of that. Some people either love it and they yeah. think this is great, this is honouring. Mm-hmm. Other people go, oh, this is a bit of a virtue signal. Yeah. What is? I, I've my ancestors go back multiple generations in Australia. Why yeah. are you welcoming me here? Yeah, I've lived here all my life. Yeah. So there's a. I know there's some controversial thoughts about it, but the Presbyterians have said, you know what? Fine for you to do it on all other events, wherever else you want to do it, just yeah. not on a Sunday service. And I can, I you know, to be honest with you, I can get behind that because a Sunday service they've come with biblical reasons uh, saying, yeah. this is about honouring God. We want to glorify Him. Yeah, we're going to stick to those things. Mm-hmm. We don't want to give honor to any other personal group, no. race, or, or or any other creed. Mm-hmm. We're going to do that. So I understand that, but my goodness, oh, has it gone off? It has blown up. Ooh. My goodness, across all the platforms. Yeah. I think. Oh, gee, when did we last? I think the last time I looked at it, it was like well over a thousand. I, I think it's getting up to close to two thousand yeah. responses across. across yeah, yeah, across Facebook, across Insta. Uh, you know, hundreds and hundreds of comments. I think there's about a hundred shares of it so going on. Many. So it's really good. And and the majority of people mm-hmm. are being very civil. Yeah. Being Christian. Yeah. Being honoring to God and honoring to each other. But there's always the outliers. So we'll let, look, let's take another break. We'll come mm. back and we'll talk about that issue. And uh, I I I'm feeling it. And I I I think we need to uh, you know address it here. DJ Leah here for the final break of the pop in. <laughs> You're with uh, V180, and uh, 
Yeah. We're getting controversial today. We are. Uh, we're touching on the on the on the you know on that uh, on that item there that is very hot. Mm-hmm. It's, it's burning. The potato is so hot. It's glowing red. It's a hot potato. It's a hot potato. We've touched it, and we don't want to burn our fingers. No, no. We're talking, of course, about the uh, the referendum, the voice to parliament, mm-hmm. and and the way that we're talking about it is is we've had a post that's probably going to be our, one of our biggest not posts, if not the biggest post of the year. Ah, uh, I think it is on Vision Radio and uh, on Facebook and Instagram, mm-hmm. talking about what the the church in Australia, the Presbyterians have decided to banning welcome to country, the indigenous welcome to country. Yeah, banning it from their church services only. Yes, and the point that we that I want I want to get to is because I I feel for both sides here. A hundred percent. Because there's times where I I do my research, I do my homework, I mm. talk to my you know in this case I'm talking to my indigenous brothers and sisters, yeah, and I and I'm and I'm getting a strong opinion about what I believe, mm. and then someone comes barreling in and saying something that I don't agree with, mm-hmm. and I have the tendency just to want to rip their head off. That's fair. To <laughs> <laughs> to to go you. to go hard and go, you idiots, and just go you're for it. You're wrong. Yeah, you're wrong. And <laughs> yeah. and I and I need to check myself and go, man. I need to remember the words of Christ. Yeah. I need to remember the words of the apostles. Mm-hmm. I need to. I have the tendency, you know, and I think it's a spiritual gifting thing. I want to speak the truth. You know, oh. you have that. You have that. Um, some people, I wouldn't ever call this about myself, but people have said you've got this calling of like a, a teacher prophet where you want to speak the truth out clearly to people. Yeah. And you might see the area that needs fixing and you want to put your finger right on it and yeah. say, this needs work right yeah. over here. Not a popular thing to do or be. No, no. Right? It can be really hard. But I have a tendency sometimes to go a bit hard in that. Uh, okay. And I can go, right, this, why aren't we moving here? Why aren't we saying this? Why aren't mm. we doing this? And I need to temper that with the love of Christ, knowing that Christ never spoke those things mm. unless he was speaking to those that he was he cared about and loved. Even the Pharisees, when when Jesus was going so hard on the Pharisees and saying that, you know, they they, you know, they were a brood of vipers and they were telling yeah. lies. It was after weeks and months and years of loving them and wanting to call them out. Absolutely. And seeing that there. So there's a tempered thing that I want to do. Mm. Uh I, I, you know, do you ever feel the same way? Do you feel like sometimes you're tempted to jump into the fray when there's a conversation going on, there's arguments, you want to get in there and have your say? Always. Yeah. Always. But yeah. I think I think too. Oh, it comes down to having a, a little bit of wisdom yes. and um, and going in with uh, taking a breath, mm. having um, and, I don't know, taking a moment of pause, yeah. a salah moment, yeah. as you yeah. could say, yeah. and, um, you know, going, okay, well, Lord, what do you want me to say in this situation? Is it going to glorify you yeah. or is it just for me just to get, to get in on the beef? Yeah. Which and, I get. Yeah. I, I beef with most people. <laughs> but And sometimes it's fun. It's it, just plain it fun. Thank you. It let's, is. Let's yes. be honest. If you're going to be that troll, sometimes being an internet troll it's is the just fun. fun. It's, the, it's the funnest thing to do. But is it helpful sometimes? Is it helpful? Not is always. Is it wise? Mm. And sometimes, it, it, like, for example, with this conversation that's going on on our socials, yeah. I think, man, I'd like to jump in there and I go, do I need to? Does this, is it, this voice, one more post, yeah. one more comment going to help in this mm. thing? Is this Maybe I just need to... Step back. Yeah. Is this a conversation that I need to be a part of? Yeah. And if yeah. it's and if it's a probably not, then maybe not. Yeah. yeah. I, look, wise words, wise words. Mm-hmm. It, however you're feeling, whatever your conversation is around this thing, speak the truth in love. Yeah. Be ready to listen uh, as well. Listen to people's always. concerns and uh, be ready, ready with an answer. Maybe you don't need an answer right there and then. No. Maybe you need to go, look, let me go away and do some homework. Let me yep. pray about this. Yep. And I'll get back to you on it. Love it. All right. All right. There we go. All right. Hey. Leah, as always, thanks for the pop in. Always a pleasure. Uh, We will see you back here next week. Mm -hmm. um, And uh, we'll keep you in our prayers when it comes to, and, and, you know, please keep me in your prayers as well. (laughs) Uh, When it comes to our keto. Yes. When it comes to our weight loss. We'll make it through the weekend. Yes, we can do it. (laughs) We can do it together. Willpower, strength, we've done so well. We've got to Saturday night. Staying on track. We need to get through the rest of the weekend here. Boom. We can, we can do, do it. it. All right. Now, if you want to get a hold of us, we would love you to uh, reach out to us. Give us that. Uh, give us your thoughts, whether it's about weight loss, whether it's about the voice, whether it's about what's happening with the Presbyterians. Yeah, absolutely. Best way to get a hold of us. Click us an email. Let us know your thoughts. Hello at v180.org.au. Yeah, you can reach out to us on uh, on the website as well, v180.org.au. Yeah. And uh, you can get all the contacts for our socials there as well. It's all there. Yeah. yeah. Very, absolutely. very simple to do. All right. We're going to leave you with some more great music. You have yourself a wonderful weekend. You have a good weekend. I will, I will. (laughs) Let's get into Seven Hills Worship right now. This is different. You've been listening to The Pop-In.
on V180. Vision 180. Vision 180. Live different. Different.